What's going on guys, my name is Cam for Christ. Today we are playing a very interesting game and I will get to that in a second, but it's Margareta. It's been a while since I've actually played like an actual indie game for a while. This is made by the same person that made the shopping list and uh, broken through. Uh, and this is actually like the first game that they made. We're just gonna get right into the game and just start the game up. I'm hoping it runs well. We're, we're, we're hoping. Developed by Jordan Lindgren. Or Lindgren. I'm hoping it runs well. Alright. There we go. Really confused on what this is supposed to be, though. Like, I don't get it. Fun. Really fun. Yes, I don't know. Where? 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 Where are huh? Huh? I don't know, but I've done this opening sequence way too many times. All I've seen is this room. All right, we can actually get into the game. Find a flashlight. Got it. I'm really slow. Is there a flashlight down here? I don't know. Yes, there is. I don't know. No, that's that's a toilet. They say put them on your f head. VMR, whatever. This. Arriba. Ah, uh, Coco. I don't like the full-on like chromatic abbreviation or whatever it's called because like it's it's. Trippy and annoying, and I don't like it, but whatever. Uh, hello, there's some weird lagging with the recording, but like it's at least not as bad as it was. Uh, and it's still fairly usable. I don't really know how to combat that other than if I was recording with a high, other than if I was recording with a um. What is this place? That's my question, but shut up, I'm talking. Um, would be just recording with another device, but I don't have a device that is capable of doing that, necessarily. At least not at the moment. Greetings, traveler. My name is David Jazz. If you can hear this, then you are currently in the North Chamber. Don't freak out. This pre-recorded message was made to help you survive this. I have stacked tapes all around this dungeon that will help you escape this abnormally large chamber. Grab the key and find the door to the next room. Best of luck, traveler. <laughs> I am David Jazz, huh? Can't fuzzled. I can't even run. That's like a problem. I can't jump. I can't run. I, all I can do is turn off this. By the way, yeah, I just, I don't have the ability to, I guarantee that's where I'm supposed to go, but we're gonna explore over here. I don't have the ability to record with a separate device right now, um, especially not like a reli reliably. Uh, so it's like, we make do with what we got. Okay, I was like, I didn't like that. What the? Speak to David. I'm not even speaking. I'm listening. Greetings, traveler. It's Greetings, me, traveler. David Jass. No, this chamber may look like some ordinary abnormally large chamber, but no, it is rather unexplored. So be cautious when looking around. Make sure to look under every nook and cranny, and keep an eye out for notes left from previous victims. There should be more tapes further out in the chambers. Good luck, traveler. <laughs> 
Cool. I don't like how laggy it is on the recording. It's supposed to be a fun little horror game, and I'm not seeing much of the horror behind it. It's in every nook and cranny, but like, honestly, I'm kind of just... Just wanting to just continue walking and see what happens. Weird shout from over there. I really don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Jazz, are you really the culprit here? That's going through the thing. Okay, I I really can't do anything. What what is what is the point of that? What is the point of any of this? What the hell are those cells used for? I just went into two of them. You're just now asking that question. Hello. I'll be with you in a moment, whatever stuff is over there. I was told to check in every nook and cranny, and I'm checking relatively every nook and cranny. Is there a reason this is lit up? Once again, what is that for? Uh, I mean, there's, there's, there's nothing to tell me what the controls are. I mess with the options enough to know that. I can't crouch. I can't jump. I can open doors and I can turn my flashlight on and off. That's it. It's E and F and then W E S D to move. And the lag is so bad right now with the recording. If I could only find like a plank or something. You're gonna make me walk back over here. To the random glowing thing. To pick up the plank. Was there really a point to that? Answer, no clue. I don't know. I keep wanting to look at my screen where I usually have my camera at. Because I have to record them separately. Kind of like I had to do for Late Mop. Where it's like I had to record the gameplay separately. And the, uh... And honestly, there may be no lag in the gameplay. Like, it may just be the pre- <laughs> Uh... Hello? I don't know, he kind of sounded like Junkrat from Overwatch. I have no clue. Door is locked. Well, I just unlocked it at that door. Uh, we're gonna go in this door because I actually just ignored this last time. That's not, oh my god, okay, hi, my name is Ted, Ted Williams, if you're reading this, you're probably in the same situation as me, or a cop, or that freak I hear screaming in the tunnels, I read these notes for three reasons, if you like, if you like me, have found yourself trapped in here, I want to share my story with you, and hope it keeps up well this issue, you will not, unfortunately, I hope this will give you a set of this case, let you know everything I've had to go through, and hopefully help give whoever is behind the, this the punishment they deserve. I want to do this to stay sane. I need to put down my thoughts or else I'll just walk around babbling myself. Here goes nothing. I woke up here less than an hour ago. The last thing I remember was that I was drinking with some friends last night. My head still feels like it's about to push through my skull. First, I thought this was another prank for my friends. They're like that. I thought they'd really outdone themselves getting across, access to some underground tunnel and hiring some guy to leave messages on a radio. But the longer the tunnels appear, 
and the higher I screamed, I started to realize it's not a prank, this is real, and I have no idea how to get it out. Then I heard it, a voice unlike any human I've ever heard before. He's shouting things in his tunnels, I have no idea what he's saying, sounds like a European language of some kind, but he does not sound friendly. I'll keep whoever you are updated later on, please be careful. Ted. This door's open now. Should probably give me the key for that door. Which will probably lead me deeper into this. Or was it this door that unlocked? Either way. Point still stands. Not excited. I know earlier this week you guys saw Vanish, but I'm not excited to record it. This is giving me. It's giving me Vanish vibes, and I'm not excited about that. It's a porta potty. Hoping to use the pooping room. Huh? What was that for? What's the point of that? I don't even know where I came from at this point. Oh, so that one area is the exit. So where I was at... Okay, so I was over here. So then I have to get... I'm here right now, meaning that's going down there. Uh, I want to go back that way and to the right is where I haven't been. I think. Uh, Bubber Bucky. Bubber Buck, the rubber duck, likes warm baths, long walks on the beach, and oatmeal. He's said to bring good fortune to have boobs his adorable beak snoot. Why can't I boop it? Glad I found it, I guess. I don't know. That was that way. Uh, we go back and then there's rooms over here because that's where I came from. There's another room back here. What's the point of this room? Answer, nothing. Okay. According to the map, that's where I came from back there. There's no point going back there, so uh, down we go. I can't poop in this one. Small shoe. The shoe weirdly smells, or weirdly enough smells like an armpit. It probably, it is probably a reminder, perhaps from the first one that was trapped in these tunnels. It wasn't a child. I have a feeling it belonged to a child, just a man with really small feet. Okay. Oh, come on. All right, I have another key. Like this game was like just making me uneasy. And I'm like worried something's gonna jump out at me. Or come running at me or whatever. So I don't know. Okay, I open door now.
Greetings, traveler. Looks like you made it. Now, there should be I'll an exit that you can crawl out of right behind that statue. I knew it was coming. Oh, we're still going. Okay, I thought that was gonna be in there. I thought jump scare and we were done. All right. There's some depth to this game. Uh, how, how the hell did I get here? Um, you got knocked out. Oh, I can run now. Hi again, it's Ted, Ted Williams. I've seen him now, that man, that thing. I have no idea what the heck his deal is, but he doesn't feel keen on me leaving. I managed to get around him and I don't think he knows where I am, but I can still hear him in the distance. Jagger Hema. What does that phrase even mean? I don't know if it will help, but I had to get through some sort of studio to get here. A bunch of easels and paints everywhere. Drawings of grown men and weird dreamish sequences. Does this freak see himself as some sort of artist? Anyways, I've also discovered that. He's a lot easier to trick and get around when he's distracted or provoked. I really hope this helps you and best of luck to both of us. If I make it, I will sure... I will make sure to leave more notes. Thank God he didn't take my notebook when he trapped me here. In case I don't make it, here's a little fact about me that might help you identify me. Uh, my name is Theodore Williams. I was born on 29th of February 2000 in Seattle, Washington. I'm a journalist, student, currently residing in LA in a part-time work at a local cafe. My parents' names are Benjamin and Natalie Williams. God, I hope this information will not be necessary. Ted. Yeah. Find and burn Noel's or Noel's drawings. Am I gonna hear something? Is gonna be like. Oh, I do have stamina. Okay, I didn't realize that. I clicked the Windows key. I was trying to see if I could run the same speed backwards. How the hell did I get here? Alright, well. Oh, I can. I can. I can run. Alright. I wish it was a toggle kind of deal, but whatever. <laughs> what was that? He, just, he just doesn't even chase me. This is going to be annoying. It's going to be vanish all over again. <laughs> I don't know why he ran the opposite direction from where I was at, but whatever. Is that it? How the fuck is this life? Not in my house. Not in my chambers. Slow down, you hot kiss fast. You can't run forever. I'm trying to be nice, but you left me no choice. I 
I'm not done yet. Rubber Bucky. I'm gonna go take a poo. Oh, I can only take one poo at a time, okay. Oh, no way I'm going through this. What other choice do you have? Going back where he was? Rusty handcuffs. He comes to rust away and seems to be broken out of someone who's been here before. Oh. Well, that makes sense. Gave yourself a concussion because you wouldn't just walk around the fire on the easily walkable stones. God, this character is an idiot. Flashback's broken. Maybe I could use one of those wounds to climb up here. What am I supposed to do? Oh. Just the random bonus right there. I couldn't have done that before. What is this game? Oh, come on, throw me a bone here. I don't know what's going on. Let's see if rock climbing classes paid off. It is I again, David Jass, and oh my, it seems like you've gotten yourself into a little bit of a pickle. But don't worry, traveler, I will help you out. You see the waterfall over there? What I want you to do is to swim right up. The waterfall is actually handmade, and it's supposed to work like a hidden elevator. They'll suck you right up. <laughs> Anyways, continue on and listen to my words. Good luck, traveler. He sounds like he sounds like the uh, whatever the Omega um, AI is when he's in Doc in Red vs. Blue. Oh my god, we're back in the... This is Tab Williams. I'm running out of ink, so I'll get this brief. Apparently, puzzles are a thing now. I don't know if it's the freak or that ra radio man that arranged it, but there's some kind of a cold lock here. I had to swim through some water to get here, so I hope it's a sauna or something. Bros, is that I found? Oh, well, we can't make some TV. The rise of the future messages might have some visual assistance. I also think I found the freak's motivations. It's apparently, his father. I missed I missed the I I I, I missed the uh Oh okay Is this supposed to help? Cuz it doesn't This is a weird tonal shift. All right, Pupper Bucky. That looks like Morse code. All 
I am not remembering Morse code for this game. Oh my god. Okay, five dashes. Zero. Five. Two. Nine. Zero, five, two, nine. Cool, got it. Mama used to make it. I'm gonna scary all of a sudden. Find your corpse, Ted. Oh no, Ted. Makes no sense to me. Oh God. This is worse than I thought it Run! want to go that other way I'm not programmed to crouch oh Love yes Bucky. no more tunnels yes you really think this isn't a tunnel hello this is your grandma Pringle do I was wondering do you by any chance know how to get epic victory royale no okay There is something about this room that feels familiar. I guess you guys made this game. This is your recording setup and everything. Oh, I could do some real damage with this one.
That's what I did like five million times. I don't know if I should be impressed or terrified. Terrified. Is this the end of the game? Hello? That's the red one out there? Oh my god, yeah, hi! Oh my goodness, finally! I've been stuck in here for so damn long. You need to help me out. Grab this key and try locking the door with it. I've kept this key for a while and I think it's the right one. I'm sorry, it's the wrong key. <laughs> No, there's another door back there that Brian had the right key. I'm going to die in here. I won't be able to survive much longer. Hey, come on, don't be so harsh on yourself. I'll see what I can do. We'll find a way out of here as long as we work together. Maybe you're right. I'm just not sure I can last much longer. Is there anything big and heavy in there? Maybe you could uh, throw it at the window. Try to break the glass. No! The maniac made the glass bulletproof. There's no way of getting out. No single way. Did you just kill me? Hmm. Well. You know, the keys for this other door. I swear to God, if I'm back, I'm ah! so done. No. Come on, please be the end. Oh, great. Mannequins. Ah, uh, Staff, you're a fantastic girl. Okay, something's off. You think? I mean, this is for that door. Come on, I hate these! It doesn't feel like home to me. I like working with shadows. In the shadows.
Are we done yet? Please, you gotta get me out of here. Please, anyone, come help. I trap a lot. Jazz? That's right. David Jazz at your service. Oh, thank God. You need to help me out of here. I will certainly try, Traveler, but this door seems incredibly secure. If you only had some explosives or something. Oh, it's not ending. Plenty of chemicals and stuff in here. Maybe I could do something with those. Brilliant! Maybe you have what is required to make some blasting dough. You're gonna need blasting this, dough? This, and also these two. But hurry, before no one catches up to you. <sighs> okay. Oh, great. Okay. Um, what did you. Oh, you're a steel. Okay, got it. And seed oil. Right there. Oh, the thread was right here. It's not, where's, where's the thread at? Well, that's not fair. Where's the thread at? Well, I'm dead. Oh, you're gonna make me watch it. The thread is where I struggle. Okay. Oh my god, it was right there. Back up, idiot. Oh my god. Jazzy Dave, or whatever your name is. <laughs> we made it. Language? But yes, you did it, Traveler. Your oh, head looks like Thank you so much, David. Covered in poo. Thank you so much. So how do we stop this son of a- Ouch! Oh, I had a bazooka. Why aren't you driving faster? You're driving like you're you're pedaling a bike. Margarita. You're safe now, child. Seducing you! Polluting your brain. You don't love them. They just want you to think that, but they can never love you! Promise me, boy, that if any one of them fags ever make you feel for them, that you punish them, because that is what they deserve. They deserve to be punished. Do you understand, boy? Do you understand? Yes, father. I understand. I promise. <laughs> Based on a true made up story, kid, I I have no words for any of that. I have no words for anything. I just I uh, I can't. I can't. I can't. All right. Well, that was Margarita or Margareta, however you want to pronounce it. I feel like I need to go to bed now. I don't really know what we just did. I'm extremely confused. I'm extremely lost. I don't know. So, um, 
Yeah. We're gonna go ahead and end this here. I don't feel okay. <laughs> I don't know what I just witnessed. I don't even know if I want to know what I just witnessed. So, uh, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy, leave a like down below and comment down below your favorite part of the video, as well as any other games you want to see me play in the future. Also, if you enjoyed this content and you'd like to see some more, feel free to subscribe and turn on notifications that we can be notified whenever I upload. Also, in the description is linked to all my other socials if you want to check me out on other platforms. But, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys! <laughs>